Good morning, ladies and gents, and I hope you are all doing well. Um, it is very early in the morning, as you guys saw. I don't want to ramble on for too much in this part because I thought I didn't ramble the last time, and it turned out I talked for quite a long time. But I'm on my way to dive, and hopefully, we're gonna have a nice day. Today's actually a Tuesday, um, so it is the middle of the week, but I have taken a few days off. Um, since none of us can really travel very much right now, it just made sense to take like a few days here and there instead and try and do things locally. So I uh, have asked my diving instructor if we could go out diving today and I think it's just the two of us which should be cool. Um, and uh, what was I going to say? Oh, I finished 47 dives, which is pretty incredible since I started diving. And if we manage, and we've planned for three dives today, and if we actually manage the three dives, that will complete 50 dives for me, which, oh my god, I would be so proud if that happened today. So, um, we are going to be pearl diving. And obviously Bahrain is well, well known for its pearl diving. We have the best pearls in the world and I'm really, really excited. So we should be doing three pearl dives today and I will take you guys along. I have also bought a GoPro, finally. So hopefully if the water is clear today, I will be able to take you down with me and I won't have to rely on anybody else's footage. So I will see you guys on the boat. So I did really 64 hours surface area, surface time. Yeah. 64 hours. Like from last time you get Yeah, from Saturday. <laughs> I like that. 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 I This is what it's like to dive with your instructor. You don't get away with anything. In Bell and BCD, Ashan, Menon Hapa, Al Edda, Ekon, Kilshi, the right amount of tightness. Kit is pretty much ready. Just gonna check, gonna clip on my alternate. So basically that is what you go down with and then that's linked to this bigger thing where you dump whatever you find in the bigger one and we're going to be linked together. thing is when you see the sea like this just the horizon nobody else no other boats just us it's 
incredible. We've just finished our second dive. We've been up for, that does not say. Oh, we've been surface interval 52 minutes. The one. Yeah, so 1230. We've already finished two dives. We're about to do our third and final dive. And the third dive is my 50th dive ever, which I'm really excited about. So it should be fun. We've had a really nice, very chill day. If you guys can see, there's like nobody here which I love. I love it when the sea is this quiet. What about you, Ayub? I love it. Have you had a good day? Yes, very much. A good body as well. Our 50th dive. Yay! Next one. And this is, and I mean, like, this is the man who taught me to dive. Hello. So, I'm pretty excited, and I'm excited that our, my 50th, and the last three dives is just the two of us together. With him as my buddy, which means I always feel really safe. It's just been really nice. It's nice to be able to get out and do these things when we don't really have that much to do um, in terms of traveling and stuff. But also, I mean, even if I could travel, this is just an amazing, amazing way to spend a day. So this is our hall. Hi, Malikla. First one. So this is Ayub's. Um, mine is... All the way over there. I think it'll be easier to show you guys once we've finished our third dive and are back on land. But we've got a lot of oysters to shuck and see if we can find any pearls. So we have now named the location after me. This is Le'alet Pearl Bed. And if you didn't know, Le'alet in Arabic actually means pearls. So very, very apt. That's our buoy with all of our um, oysters underneath and he's just taking a little little break on top. I'm going to show Ayub doing the hard work of actually bringing up the mahar. The mahar. So they're two or they're both mine and his are currently Attached to the same bunch. Yep. It's a good workout. <laughs> <laughs> this one's his. This little baby one is mine. It's not a dive with Ayub. If there is not a watermelon involved. <laughs> All right, talk to us. So this is the very first oyster that I have ever opened. And of course there's nothing here. So we're gonna get rid of this one, but I'll open another one with you guys. So this is the haul from today. This is what I've managed to to put together. So here we go. Let's try. Let's try opening this guy. And if someone knows, if someone can force to feel the, the stone, I wahde the force we edit. With Sonia, to okay. feel when you look, you can feel yes. Let's just take a moment for this 
teeny tiny natural pearl right here that is the very first pearl that I have ever managed to get and this is so pearls in Bahrain um, in Arabic rather are called Lulu uh, which is a single pearl my name is Laale which is multiple pearls so it's quite special to be able to have found this and um, I've got I'll, I have more oysters to shock this isn't all of them but yeah just wanted to share the very first one with you guys Hey guys, so I am back home and I've just had an absolutely incredible day. I'm so, so happy. I'm really, I'm not actually as exhausted as I usually am by diving, which is strange because I did an extra dive and we were out most of the day, but I am feeling good. I'm just about to hop in the shower and then head out to my aunt's house. So I think I will leave this vlog here. I feel like it's quite, quite self-contained and you guys can see what it's like to go pearl diving in Bahrain. I'm no expert by any means, but it, would, it was nice to be able to share that and show that with you guys. So please like this video if you've liked it and please subscribe if you want to see more of me. I do all sorts of things from scuba diving vlogs to food content to travel content when we can travel um, and style and fashion content. So I will see you soon. Bye.